Hello adventurers and welcome to Let's Play Dungeons of Dreadmore. I'm your host Lord Vincent 26 and I'm not very good at this game so this ought to be interesting. Uh, I'm going to be playing it on normal and permadeath on which basically means when I die, that's it. Game over. So it's going to be interesting. Hopefully I won't fuck up too badly. Now I'm probably going to... I might go through... I'm going to go through most of these and then you know, let you guys... you know in case you guys are interested, so you got your, obviously your sword, which means you get bonus with your swords and you can actually understand them. Basically, when you start the game off, if you have a sword and you haven't selected swords, your character will be like, I don't know, I don't understand how to use it, so he's going to be quite bad at using it, so we're definitely going to have that. Don't really care for axes or maces, so not really my problem, or staffs. Um, most of the top line don't need to worry about, because it's, uh, you got uh, arch um, you know, archery, which is using crossbows and all that. Throwables, you have throwable weapons in here, like you have baseballs, you have um, you have loads of stuff to throw, so it's always good. Unarmed combat, very good, but not really my kind of thing, unfortunately. Dual wielding, it used to be my thing, but I've kind of you know, backed myself away from that. Uh, I'm, I am tempted to get the shield one, but for the time being, we'll just stick with what I want, which is, so far, I want the Berserk Rage, which gives me bonus to my attack, so every so often, I'll want a bonus attack. We're going to get the um, Artful Dodger, which is basically, um, some points in the game, you'll see, like, a little bit of water, or well, I'll explain that one later, um, but basically, it's really useful for me, um, using armor, and I'm going to go for Pyromancer, Py I'm going to be a Pyromancer. Alright, or whatever you want to call it. And I'm going to, because, you know, fire damage, it's cool. Blood ma uh, Mage actually lets you restore. We're going to go for Archaeology, which is very good as well. And, um, actually, I think what we're going to do is we're going to substitute one of my other ones, which will probably be the Rage one. And we're going to have the Burglar, which allows us to actually get lockpicks. Now, hopefully, most people are looking at it going, Oh, no, that's a really bad class, that's terrible, but... Like I said, I'm not brilliant at this game. I'm not fantastic. I'm still kind of new to it, so I probably will fuck up. And this is probably already a fuck up right here. So <laughs> you guys be the choice. I don't really mind. Okay, so we're done. Let's uh, yeah, let's actually choose our um, our name. Shit, who didn't see that one coming? Honestly, who didn't see that one coming? All right, we're done. And there's a storyline, which is basically Dreadmore is like, you know, there's a war going on, blah blah blah. And it's up to us, the adventurer, to venture forth and destroy all evil, naturally. So, let's get into the game. So, welcome to Dungeon Dreadmoor. Please enjoy your stay. <laughs> uh, not played the tutorial. Well, I haven't played the tutorial, and I don't need no tutorial. I've already played this once, and uh, I should be alright. Let's see, let's open this door. What do we get in here? Oh, right off the bat, a quest. These statues that give you quests, uh, little side ones. Sometimes it could be anything between fighting enemies to just trying to get a, um, a specific item. Oh, uh, just to show you, you got two skills down here. One of them is lockpick. When you use lockpick, boom! Three lockpicks. Lovely. Right. And, oh, would you look at that? We already found the shop. That is nice. We're going to have to keep that in mind because uh, we might have to come back and get ourselves a better weapon. Oh, and just to show you, because... Oops, wrong one. Because we chose the archaeology. Ha ha ha. Yeah, Indiana Jones style, bitches. Life is good. I don't know why I just did that. I might as well just use the arrow keys. You can use arrow keys or you can click. Whatever works best for you. And. Oh, damn, another quest? Wow. Um. Wow, game. That's fucking weird of you. How about thee? How about thee? Get away. Gotcha. Oh shit, this ain't good. To regain health. Oh, that's not good. Um, there's a high chance we might die, viewers. Uh, I think I've done fucked up. Already? Wow, that didn't take long, did it? Alright, just eat that. And... While we're fighting... To yeah, I just ate some food, go away. Oh shit! Where the fuck did you come from? Get away from me. Ah, pretty quick, good. Okay, I think we're gonna eat some more. I want full health because uh, this ain't a good start. Oh, and there we go, some experience. Basically, because we got the burglar and the archaeology, we can spot traps and we can deactivate them just a little bit more easier than what other people can. And oh, we're gonna take that and open you. What have you got? Nothing. Yep, thank you. And oh, some arrows. 
Uh, we'll probably sell them later, actually. So it's always good to keep them, keep that in mind. Uh, Alright, we'll go through this door. Ah, now with fountains, it's always random. I can either get poisoned or uh, I can probably get acid or whatever. So it's always random. Hopefully, we'll get something nice, but I'm not going to risk it just yet. I think I'm just going to like. Oh, yes. Lots and lots of health, lots and lots of food. Everything we need here. Very nice. That's a good find. Oh, there's an enemy down there. Fire! Boom! Come here. Come on, you wanker. Come on, you wanker. Yeah, take that bitch. Uh, let's open the chest and we got... Oh, berries. Nice. Um, yeah, uber chests, they are... They can only be activated... Oh, shit, didn't mean to do that. They can only be activated when you actually... Um, oh, I think it's one of those... When you pull a lever somewhere randomly, you'll get it. So, you need to hope. Oh, just do that really quickly. Just set him on fire. Wait. Wait for him to come to us. That's the best trick. Don't go towards them. Let them come to you. It helps a lot. Honestly, God, I could go into more depth about how you can use alchemy and everything, which is very useful, but I'm not really one for alchemy. Oh, hang on. That's a rusty shield. Can I equip that? Let's find out. Let's have a look. And... Okay, yeah, sure. I think we'll equip that. That gives us a bit of armor. It's not a lot, but hey. Every little helps. No, I wanted to click on that and keep it, not drop it on the floor next to me. Robe, which is probably crap. And, alright, we'll head down from here. And... Oh, a way to go down, but we're not going to go down there just yet. Oh, crap. I just stepped into a trap. That was clever. Uh, have we got anything I can eat? Yeah, I think I'll eat that. It's not a lot, but it's enough. The thing is, you don't want to, um, hold on, what's the helmet? Ah, uh, no, I want to keep my, my, um, my nice little hat on. But basically, you want to be careful with most of these. Like this one, it's a 50-50 chance. It says you've got 40% chance. It's more or less, you're not going to get it, watch. See? Not going to get it. Alright, um, I think that pretty much sums up this entire area. Yep. Let's have a look. That's an open door, so why don't we just open this up and... Oh, that's not good. You need more mana. We need more mana. Brilliant. This ain't gonna go well. Oh, this is not going well at all. I am so screwed. Okay, let's just get down here. You need more mana. I need more mana. Shit! Come on, give me that little bit more mana. How much is it again? Ten. Holy crap! Alright, like this, they can't actually all gang up on me now. Which is always good. So we're going to take these out one at a time now. Perfect. Oh, level up. Brilliant. Now what I'm going to learn is the rune exploding. Explosion, sorry. What it does is it will put a rune down on the floor and cause a huge fuck of explosion. Which, in my opinion, is very useful. Uh, actually, I shall demonstrate right now. Run away. There you go. Did you hear that? Did you hear all those enemies dying? I'm going to take that, and I think I'm going to walk around. There you go. There's another enemy on fire because of my little... Oh, fuck off. Little douche. Alright, and it should be safe. No, it's not safe. Damn it, come on. Oh, run away. Oh, also you get resistance to um, items. Oh, yeah, that's money. Want to pick that up? And we're kind of we got a bit of resistance towards fire due to choosing to be a pyromancer. So basically, it helps a little bit. Um, we're not doing too well, are we, viewers? Um, most of these, it's always a missing hit. Sometimes you can Ooh. fight. Oh, go away! I know I'm low on food. Low on health, sorry, not low on food. What we're we talking about? Alright, so there should be, I think they spoke about an anvil in here. Right, let's open this up. Come on. Now, right, so, so far we're not doing too badly. I mean, it could be a lot worse, but... I'm just kind of grateful it's not. <laughs> There's an anvil. Uh, we're not going to bother with that just yet. Instead, we're going to bother with these enemies. There we go. And there's an enemy there. And I think we're going to place that there. <laughs> Whoa, brilliant. 
Okay, so let's walk around then. Uh, there's a couple of anvils in here which I think we can later on. We could try and repair them, which is kind of useful, but for the time being we don't have enough skill points to do that. Or I don't think I actually have the skill to do it to start with, so... Also, I'd like to point out, all maps are random generated, so you don't know. Sometimes you'll get lucky and, you know, you'll find something very useful, or sometimes you'll just... you won't. That was stupid of me, I've got to walk over that. Um, it all depends on where you are, because with some maps you can probably just walk around and you'll be like, Hey, look, I found this! And most people will be like, Oh my god, I haven't found that, that's not fair, bro. Oh, ho, ho! Oh, wait, hang on. Oh, I can't get to this room, I'm going to have to remember this room, right? Because we can get that. We can get that in a bit. Uh, yeah. Poison. Goddamn poison. Alright, let's eat some more food. And that was pretty wasteful, actually. I do apologise. Like I said, sorry about that. Like I said, I'm not an expert at this game. Oh my god, these are the most powerful bolts in the game. And they are insane. They just... It's like a nuke. Um... Right, let's have a look in this chest and more pot, uh, more um, lock picks, which reminds me actually. Can do that. All right, then. Oh shit! I forgot to mention you can use the wheelie mouse to select your skills. For example, boom. Oh, he's trapped. Here you go, buddy. Let's help you out. Come here. Come here. Come on, bitch. Motherfucker be trying to trip balls if he thinks he can take me on. Motherfucker! Oh, empty fl flask. Just settable. It's all settable, really. Hey, is that cake? It's a cake. Can I have cake? I want cake. This is weird. I've never seen anything like this before. I'm not gonna lie, I haven't seen this before. That's very weird. Uh, what's that called? Ooh, okay. And, oh! Trap on the floor. Oh, yes, and here we go. Shit, I completely walked into that one, that was stupid of me. Okay, um, you get these pads here, which they will teleport you to another part of the entire dungeon, which is kind of good and kind of bad. It's good, oh, new weapon, which is always useful. It's kind of good due to the fact that, you know, you can probably use it to, you know, get you from point A to point B, and in case you're in trouble, like, you're facing enemies and they're about to mess your sword up, then... Maybe it's useful to have that, but generally it's only means of transportation really. You just use it to get from point A to point B. You don't have to worry too much about it. We're not going to get go on there just yet because as you tell, there's a lot to the dungeon. Uh, let me just do that. As you tell, this dungeon is quite big. Oh, hang on. Sleeping enemy. Hell yeah. <laughs> ah, see? See what I mean by how useful that really is? You know, it does, it will, it, this kind of, um, this class will save your bacon more than once through the entire game, so it's always good to keep it in, you know, use. Well, unfortunately, there is a lot for me to explain about this game, which I, all that I can explain, because that's all I know, but. Oh, shit, didn't mean to do that. Hey, level up. Alright. So, we can even use that one, which, uh, actually, we're going to aim for that one. Fireball, very, very useful. So we're gonna use this one for the time being because let me just open this up again. Nah, I don't care if I get hit by that. Oh yeah, um, drinking alcohol in this game restores your mana. So uh, by those terms, I must be a fucking wizard because I drink alcohol that like you wouldn't believe. Now I'm kidding, viewers. I'm, I'm I don't drink that badly. Although I'm pretty sure some people probably disagree. Right, let's have a look here. What's down here? And it's just money, more money. Which, by the way, most people are probably thinking, what's the point of money? Well, remember what I mentioned up here, in the top corner part? That's useful. Uh, I don't know if this is lagging or not, it feels like it is, but... I don't know, maybe the video will be like, ah, it's not lagging that much. But, if it is, then I do apologise, my PC's been playing up recently, and uh, in my opinion, it feels like it's really lagging, but... I don't know, maybe I'm just paranoid, because every time my PC does something, I'm kind of like, shit, hang on. What's happened? What have you done? What have you done? What have you done, PC? Oh, cool. Oh, got it. And I'm just paranoid because the last thing I want is for my PC to break on me. Come on. Oh, come on. 
fool to regain health. I know. Don't tell me fucking hell. This game thinks I'm a dipshit sometimes. There. See that. Oh yes, I forgot to mention by the way. I know my health is low. Thanks game. I've got this, I've got this, I've got this. See, told you. Totally had it. Totally had it. Wasn't gonna about die just then. Oh cool, well cool. Alright. Um Also, these are traps which normal enemies that are ground enemies, they can activate them and hurt themselves. But if you're flying a flying one, which nine out of ten times you probably will, these don't class as fly by the way. Just want to say that now. These don't class as flying, so don't worry. Um, yeah, if I can disarm that. Head down. Oh, no one to disarm. Oh, and an en enemy! Come on, come on! Just die already! Thank you. Okay, so let's head right. Bad idea! I know, oh my god, this game thinks I'm really stupid. Wow, he really done fucked me up just then. Uh, what's that? What the hell was that? I just picked something up. What? what did I just pick up? What did I just pick up? Game, what did I just pick up? Um, oh, so you can wait if you want. Uh, that'll, let's have a look, what's this? Oh, it's the thing I need to collect, okay. Um, anything to do with healing? Oh, there you go. Okay, so I'm not doing a very good start. <laughs> I'm doing quite bad, I think. Uh, most people will probably be like, "Oh no, 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 it's all, it's, it's all right. You're doing all right." But I don't know. I think I'm doing quite shit right now. It's not very comforting. It's not bode well for the rest of the LP. I tell you that. Um, I should be fine. Hopefully, just uh, play cool. There you go. Oh, I didn't set him on fire. Oh well, still killed him and. Um, Health does regenerate by itself, by the way, so as long as you just keep walking it. Fuck. Um, oh, yeah, there is an achievement on this that I've yet to explain. There are achievements. Um, if you get so and so to a certain level um, and all that, so. Oh, God. Oh, two critical hits. That's very, very lucky. Okay, and. Oh, yes, here we go. Lovely. Food. For the offsprings. So basically, diggles were, were basically you've got to eat their children. Yeah, that's pretty much the sum of it. And I think that class is cleared, so let's head back and down. Alright, now the worst luck you can get when you open these doors is that you run to a zoo. That is something you don't want. You definitely do not want that. Wanting is not. Because if you run to a zoo, you better kiss your sorry ass goodbye. Oh my god, I'm going to kiss my sorry ass goodbye. Uh, place that there. Try and do that then. Nice. Okay. Well, that's a bit of a waste of mana. I do apologise. And uh, and you're probably wondering why are you apologise to me because I'm trying to keep this as entertaining as I can. But I don't know. It's a bit difficult due to you know stuff happening and everything. And there's a high chance that you probably won't keep entertaining. I oh, sorry, I won't keep entertaining you, or you won't be entertained, you two. You need more mana. Drink I need... more booze. I, I don't know if you heard that, but he said you need more mana. Drink some more booze. So uh, yeah, see like the game. Uh, the game encourages you. You know, drink alcohol, people. Come on, you know, fucking. Yeah, I'm gonna use that as an excuse. Next time we're down a pub, I'm just you know, just be sitting there. Sorry, just adjusting myself. I'm gonna be sitting there, just going, you know, so. You know, dude, dude, why are you drinking so much? I need to get my mana up. You know, it's alright. I'm sure I can pull it off somehow. <laughs> if I don't, then at least we... Uh, but I'm going to try anyways, and if people don't get the reference, then... Ah, well. Which, you know what, don't you just hate when that happens? You know, there you are, talking about a reference to a game, and... Or to a film. And nobody, nobody but you gets it. Actually, you know what, I think we're going to take this teleport down here. I find that really irritating because you're like, you know, you say something and you expect people to go, ha ha, I get it, I get it, but, you know, oh, that's not good. Oh, yeah, he's asleep. Sneak attack! Well, oh, what a douche. Oh, right, cracked ore. Um, that can go on these, which are rings or whatever, so this one gives me 
um, I don't know what that gives me actually. Oh, actually, I think uh, it goes on your shield. Increases my mana. That's uh, that's a good enough reason to have it that I can ever think of. Ah, uh, here we go. Statues. Destroyed statue. Get heroism vandalism. I think it's hero vandalism or whatever. But yeah. Oh. Hey guys. Uh, here you go. Go get for you. Go, Petty. Kick their ass. Hey. Leave him alone. Not cool. Oh, I didn't want to walk into that. Alright, get back out again. Alright, so, yeah, she told it apparently leads us to lots of locations. So, this is one big area then. Yeah, this is our pet dragon. There we go, he's got to follow now. Let's just take it nice and slow for him to catch up. And, oh, take that. And I think I'm going to deactivate that. Block pick, which, you know, you can bash the um, things open. Yeah, I'm going to give it a try. Oh, took like a trooper. Well done, boy. Oh, pet took it like a trooper, didn't he? Bless him. Nice, Matt Q. He fired you. Ha, <laughs> teamwork. Beautiful. Right, so, hopefully, you know, <laughs> hopefully it'll run into a, an actual zoo. Uh, not just yet, though, because I kind of... Oh, you didn't even give me a chance. Come on, not cool. And oh damn! Ha, <laughs> nice. And oh, almost walked into that one. Okay, and oh, don't want to do that. Let's pick up the offspring and uh, continue on. Beautiful. All right. Let's open this up then. And enemy. Hits. And it's so weird because I'm looking at the map. And it's weird how where we've just ended ourselves up. Um, fuck uh, that one thing. Beautiful. Basically, because they're on fire, they take extra damage. Really, that's the only difference. Um, uh, okay, let's try it. Oh, son of a bitch, game. I can't right now. I'm kind of getting my ass kicked. Do you mind? Fucking game. Okay, um, let's have a look. Where is the health? I know I've got some. There you go. It's not much, but it will do. And oh, some more health. Lovely. Alright, let's open this up. Somebody used a trap and it kind of killed them. Not my health is low bullshit again. I eat this. You shit and die. So I got to nuke him on the brain. Uh, here we go. And if we pull the sleeper, it should say you hear sounds on the machine. That basically means a chest has been opened. One of those. Um. Oh damn. Shit. 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 Goodbye. I don't think I'm better off right now. Yeah, I ain't better off. Shit, 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 shit. Goodbye. Shit, shit, shit. Is he a boss? Nope. Okay. Shit, 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 shit. Goodbye. Okay, so somewhere around here, a pet dragon's fucked. Oh, there he is. Where were you when I needed you, boy? Fucking dragon. Um, have I got anything I can use to heal? Uh, normally I'm not this bad. I think this is the. Um, I think this is what they call the Let's Play curse, where you play by yourself, perfectly fine, nothing to worry about, you're all good. But, no, this is definitely the... Oh, we go! A lot picked it, so I get another class, which then I get Fireball! One of the best skills in this game, my personal opinion. Right, let's bring him over here. And we'll start a fight, that's what you get. Alright, and oh, we get leg pieces, go to some that, take that, take that, okay now I'm going to show you, hopefully, if we get to a big number of enemies, add the stick, you can see why I like it, can't you? Very nice, very, very nice. You know what I just realised, I must have collected a load of these, so, surely, where have they gone? They're not down the bottom part here, are they? They're not down there, so where are they? Oh, that the top there, that's why. Alright, we're going to switch them over. And actually, while I'm here, I might as well check what do I have. I have a shirt that gives me that, and a robe that 
probably it's actually it's worse, yeah, so fuck that. Okay, let's go. On the road again. I just can't wait to get on the road again. <laughs> Boom! <sighs> I love it. So satisfying. Let's drink some of that. Lovely. If we'll store some mana. Whilst I'm walking. Ah, here we go. And I think we're gonna <laughs> just for the hell of it. And there you go, a few traps. Yeah, go on. Oh, trooper! Look at that, looking like a champ, man. We'll get there in the end. We we'll keep trying this all day if we have to. Yeah, it's all right. We could just resummon him. That's the best part. There we go. Took us a while, but we got there in the end. All right, so let me just get some more lock picks. Go back to fireball. And since we got the fireball, we are pretty much almost set for the entire game because the fireball is just the best. You see what I mean? <laughs> and that enemy is kind of in the fire, so he'll slowly die. Right, let's pick all this up, which we can sell. Which is always welcoming. Uh, like I said, we will be going back to the shop. Yep, there you go, thought so. And another wand. Okay, yeah, we're good. Uh, let's drink. Where is it? Nope, nope, nope. That's it. That's what I want. And oh, a bookshelf. And we learnt how to make that. Basically, these they they will teach you different things every single time. So it won't always be a simple you learnt this or you learnt that. It'll basically be over time. And. Oh, good dragon. Good dragon. See, that's why it's very useful to have. Yeah. What? Thank you. Oh, wow. That looks like a pretty badass motherfucker. So I think we'll place it about there. There we go. Perfect. We've still got that brain as well. I don't know where I'm supposed to drop that off. So I'm pretty sure it's one of those you drop it off and then you fight a boss kind of thing. Oh, so satisfying. Such satisfaction. I, I know I shouldn't, but you know, I do. And, okay. Alright then, cool. Let's continue downwards. You need more mana. I need more Drink mana. More okay, just do that then you instead. Need more mana. Need more mana. Oh my Boots. god, I still need more mana anyways. Okay. One on one. Yeah, actually, though, he's quite beaten up, so he won't survive long, unfortunately. Uh, I think this is where you can... Yeah, here you go, throwable items. Here you go, here's all of them. Bombs, well, it's not all of them, but yeah, most of them. Uh, you can tell how much they cost, and yeah, why you wouldn't want them. Because, you know, I don't think it's one of those... I think if you get a skill, it will allow you to actually... Hang on. Trap. Uh, oh, an item. Okay, and here we go. Oh, fuck off. Fuck off. Thank you. Wow, that was a tough enemy. That was kind of surprising. Didn't expect him to be here. Uh, okay. Drink some more mana. Here we go. Okay, so it just leads to another lower floor area, which... Like I said, I'm gonna... Oh, I forgot to mention at the beginning. We're gonna be doing this floor by floor. It won't be just a straightforward... We're gonna go, you know, all, all the way around just to get to where we need to go. It pretty much will... Uh, oh, just tackle it one at, step at a time, really. Okay, and... Yeah, go on. Oh, lucky. Um, oh, shit. Gotta go down here now, because we've got to go down here. And, ooh, Ruby. Enemy. Get out of it. Um, I will probably, hopefully, try and get a better weapon. As you can tell, my, my pet is really messed up right now, so I think what I'm going to do is just resummon him so that he's actually got, you know, he's full, he's fully healed now and it only costs a bit of mana, so. Oh, damn. Pet, help me. Oh, oh, oh teamwork. And health wise, I think we're doing alright. I'm. Um, not too sure, but hopefully we'll... Ow! Shitting cock fags, you...
What the? Oh yeah, I hit my enemy. I hit my pet by accident. I wanted to disarm it, and he accidentally activated the trap again. Fucking hell. Enjoy. Thank you. Alright then. Um, I think we're getting to the half an hour mark, actually. So, one moment, viewers. <laughs>